Hello there, my friends. Chris Mark is here with you for the Miles Franklin channel. And today, a quick video about gold backed cryptos. As the crypto sector has evolved, there have been a few projects which have married the idea of doing something with the blockchain where you have a clear distributed ledger that shows, the way I think of it is actually an honest accounting system as opposed to some of the markets like, for example, the COMEX where there's a lot more paper traded than actual metal exists. So there have been various groups going back and forth about combining the two to get some sort of digital gold where the metal is actually there, believe it or not. And it was interesting, Doug Casey and Rick Rule uh, through Casey Research had a conversation and sent out an interview that they did here. And it's interesting because Rick actually talks about Vault Chain, which is a gold-backed crypto that Miles Franklin is a partner with, uh, Rick Rules Sprott Global is a partner with. And it's interesting because essentially, one way of thinking of it is that it's similar to GLD and SLV, except the fees are a lot lower. And also, as Rick talks about here, the gold is stored at the Royal Canadian Mint. And again, you have a clear transaction. You have an audit that the metal is verified to be there. Um, and as he mentions here, it's important that people understand that this distributed ledger receipt represents actual gold stored by us at the Royal Canadian Mint. It's redeemable for gold and it's interchangeable which is really an interesting product. Last year up in the San Francisco Silver and Gold Summit, I was fortunate to get to sit down with Rick Rule and talk with him about that in an interview. And he actually mentioned that it's simple enough. Rick is <laughs> Rick's a great speaker and I love the way he phrases things. He's like, if I could use the technology, anybody could do it. And he talked about how he actually went, bought vault chain units through his phone, tested selling them to see if his money came back and then actually repurchased Vault Chain again and had it redeemed and had metal sent to him personally. And I believe he mentioned that he did it under someone else's name. So it wasn't so if someone would see Rick Rule and do this, but actually tested it to make sure it worked properly before recommending it to anyone else. And I'll put the link to these interviews below. Um, certainly one of the features I believe Doug mentioned in part one of this was how one of the advantages this offers is that should you be traveling or wanna go somewhere else, if you take $50,000 of gold on an airplane, they're gonna ask you to declare it. Um, and God knows what the TSA would even do after that, but here it's, it's a way of storing your wealth that you can have that you don't have to take on the plane, but anywhere you go, you have access to it. And again, certainly in this era where I'm very cautious about paper, gold and silver products and believe in the importance of having physical metal that you have access to, this is slightly different than having physical metal in your house or in a safe or wherever you choose to store it, but certainly a great way of diversifying so that you don't leave everything in one location. And here you have the backing of Sprott Global, Miles Franklin. If we scroll down here, I believe Rick mentioned some of the other shareholders that are registered, Gold Core, Wheat and Precious Metals, I Am Gold, Agnico Eagle, so while anytime you have, well, really anytime you have metal or anything else, there's always some risk. So there's nothing is going to be 100%. And yet, if you look at some of the partners involved, I like that if something happens, you have known groups with great reputations that are on your side and backing the product Whereas with some of the other paper, gold and silver products, maybe you just have a number on a screen and there's no one to actually talk to or go get help from if something does come up. So I'll leave the links to the interview below. Certainly worth taking a read and if nothing else, being aware of, although if you would like more information or are interested in purchasing units of vault chain, 
you can call Miles Franklin at 1-800-822-8080 and you can get some more information and find out how to do that. So with that said, we'll wrap up for today, but hit the darn subscribe button. I'll keep you posted with all the most important developments in the gold and silver market going forward. Thanks. Thanks.